Well, the scramble for Glad Africa Championship playoff places intensifies with practically every passing week. And even a side like Utungati, well outside the top half, are still in the reckoning. But they need to begin collecting points with urgency, starting against today's visitors, JDR Stars, a side who could crash the top three party with a positive result today. Yes, Macheco is the man to toss that back into play. Now it's with Silla Lotwani. Space emerging here for Ngube. He lays it off. Chawunga turns over the responsibility and it has been slotted in from the edge of the area. Passed into the back of the net. An absolutely marvellous goal from Tebukho Mabula. Mocheke, he started with the throw-in, got the pass back, nobody closed him down. It was a one-two played with Lutwani, and he cut inside to Ngube, who's dangerous at the box, and he set it very well. Look at the tap-in by Mabula. He noticed that Amonome is out of his goals, he's not covering the nearest post, and he just tapped it in. <laughs> Big chance here for Utungati. Sangare, their former player, goes in rather robustly on Moketa Lesua. And the referee is, uh, well, he's not moved by the appeals. Let me tell you, he's very lucky, Sangare, because he was coming from behind, from Sufi. But he got the ball. That's why the referee said, well done. If he didn't touch that ball, we could have seen maybe a penalty. But look at it. His right foot on top of the ball, controlling it. So he picks it up with his feet. And yes, Dube and Kleppas Dube rolls it into an open goal for his first of the season. Dreadful mistake and Utsungati profits. They are level with 10 minutes until the interval. The mistake he did. Look where he's facing, and he's a left footer. He didn't see a Dube make that run, and for Dube to stay up and become strong. Sangare tried to pull him down, but he was, he was strong. Stayed on his feet and pounced on the ball. That's an alert striker in the right area. Last season, they didn't manage it at all. All seven instances where they conceded first, they went on to lose five and draw two. Now, big chance. Still in the 20, could only really throw a, a foot at that and he got a toe poke in the end that was wide of the target the control from Ngube up front he's able to control the ball and turn and make a split decision knowing very well that Lutuano will be the brilliant defense from Slaula <laughs> That is a wonderful point-blank stop from the former Utungati man, Badra Sangare, to deny Klippas Dube a second. And the Zimbabwean can barely believe it. From the right-hand side, look at the perfect cross come from Zamini, just in between the defence and the keeper. And Dube doing excellently, everything right with a diving header. But Sangare, the pillar of this JDR team. Now Issa Saar, he heads that one wide. Well, Utungati, in the space of a minute, have conjured two tremendous chances. Isasa going up very well. Remember, the first half, they were playing it to the far post. Now they are picking Isasa from the near post. And what a powerful connection covered by the defenders. <laughs> Now shot from distance. Oh, Pafana Kali with a little skip and a jump after hitting that. He had expected it to whiz into the top corner. The ball coming long, but the control of Augusta to welcome Kali in with a shot. It's really just setting him up and Kali taking it brilliantly just off the mark. Altanen Zeka has glanced down at his watch. And he has blown the whistle for the last time here at the Princess Mogogo Stadium. It's a share of the spoils, a point apiece, and a point that doesn't serve either side particularly well. So as the sun begins to set here in Kwamashu, we can confirm after 90 minutes of thrilling Glad Africa Championship action, this match ends in a draw. Utungati won. JDR Stars won.